still compromised? Damn, we lost track of the bastard. Oh. What is going on, real squad? And welcome back to the Real Flicks channel. And this is Hitman 3. Guys, this game came out about a week or two ago. I'm not exactly sure, but it, it was newly released. And I'm excited to play. I do have a bit of a confession. I have never played any of the Hitman games, but I have seen them played by others. And for what I've seen from some of the gameplay uh, this past week, it looks like it's very promising and I cannot wait to dive in. So without wasting any more time, y'all, let's get into this. Look closer. In the Ooh. shadows. Okay. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power. A hidden hand. A kind of company known as... Is that his friend? Is his childhood friend they're talking about? To it, we were just assets. To use and throw away. Damn. To do the unthinkable. The unforgivable. And it never gave us a second thought. Kingdom Until of Saudi Arabia. Now, after decades in the shadows, we are fighting back. Me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. So they could just control us straight in? Constant. Providence's chief controller. Hey, they're on the desert? We finally learned the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. Is that where they're at? Are we going to... Just maybe. Look towards the future. Are they, are they jumping out of something? 47. It's time. We're literally going to just... We're literally going to just jump into this. Okay. What is that? Hitman 3. Okay, I like the nostalgic buildup. I like it. Okay. Ooh. Why does it sound like Marvel music, like superhero Partners music? Are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. You just talking so casually while you fall? Wait, is that a beacon? Missiles. Oh, woo! <laughs> yeah, it would have been a wrap. Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations. Over. Diana, that's the status. Hey, how far right. are they? We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building, and I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar Al-Ghazali. Okay. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking, and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Whoa. Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War, and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both okay. families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Sounds Stuyvesant good. and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Ooh, let's get it then. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Eliminate Carl Ingram Today, and Marcus, whatever that says. Favor. Happy hunting. We got two targets. Welcome to Dubai, 47. 
Today is the inauguration of the Septum, and the ceremony is well underway. Yeah, so many people. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. Okay. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Hmm. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. On top of the world. 47. Come in. 47, do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards the point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Look at how high up we are, y'all. Jesus. I'm thinking taking out Carl might be better because we could leave him in his penthouse. We could leave him in his penthouse while we kill the other dude. Ooh, I like this. The inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. Don't we are worry. so close, 47. Don't, Don't worry, we got it. They're not going anywhere. We got it. First things first, though, I gotta find some sort of disguise. Oh, okay. I like how you did that. Hello. Good to see you. How I like to see so many. Well, there's one. This has been a dream of mine for a great many years. Oh. And as all of you know, I am one of the less privileged sides of the respectable Alan mm. Not my target. Hello there. They're both up there. I know I'm not gonna be able to just walk up to them. I'm gonna have to get a disguise at some point. Who is this? Oh, it's just a precaution. I've been personally invited by the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali. I should have clearance. The name is Zaina Kazim. Oh. Sir, I understand, but you can't enter without being searched. It's standard procedure. This is ridiculous. Well, that's how it is. Think about it and come back if you want. I'll be waiting upstairs in the reception. Understood. So I need to follow him. Yeah, I need his outfit. Mm-hmm. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Shut up, shut up. Be quiet. Be quiet. Okay? Alright. Give me a He got a gun and a knife on him. No wonder he didn't want him to search him. If I could get one of their outfits, I know I'd be able to go up there. Greeting. Hey bud. Oh, greet it. You're not allowed to be here, sir. Oh, okay. Please okay. leave. Okay. Uh, is it because I have the gun? Now. <whistles> yeah, go ahead, frisk me down. I mean, you'll find a knife on me, but I mean, besides that. You'll be on your way in a sec. Uh huh. Good. Yeah. All right. Good job, sir. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Now, I know if I can get one of their outfits, I will be in business. How am I supposed to... Oh. I'm going to have to get frisky. Just keep right? calm. They got guns. They ain't playing. Right? Can... Do I get frisked? Oh, okay. Whew. If I get one of their outfits, I'm in business. Security room. If I can just get... He's sleep. He's sleep. Now's my chance. Yep, now's my chance. Yes. Yes! Okay. Um. No, no, no. Put the knife up. How do they see you? I need the camera so my boy can hack it. I got poison? Where'd that go from? Can I turn this off? Okay, so if he's going to do that... What does that mean? Shut up! Shut up! Come here! Come here! Come here! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Be quiet. Give me your disguise! Yep. This is what's gonna give me that clearance. Come on. Get you up in here. 
Go ahead, you sit there, you chill, you take a nice little nap, okay? Perfect. All right, penthouse key card. I'm gonna need that. Thank Hello. you. Yeah, just wanted to remind you about the uh, lockdown drill tomorrow. That's right, 900 hours. And the key cards to activate the alarms are still in the safe and the security room. Yeah, it's oh. code 6927. 6927. Okay. Okay. Okay, but remember, you need to activate the alarm on both floors, otherwise, nothing's gonna happen. Six, nine, yeah, two, two, I'll talk to you later. seven. Beautiful evacuation. I need that. Hey, you! Quiet. Shut up! Shut up! Ah, get, sit down. I'll take your weapon. Put that up. Uh, you talk too much. Ah, let's go ahead and snap your neck real quick. Um, let's go ahead and drag you somewhere. Storage, yep. Uh, oh, let's go. Alright, well. That's what we're doing, huh? Nobody else heard that? Come on. Put you in here with your friend. All three of y'all dead. Drop you right there. Alright. Whew! My God. And I'm just gonna walk out like ain't nothing happened. Like, y'all didn't hear none of that gunfire going on. All right. We're paid to do. Where yeah, is he? It'll probably never happen. He's right above Just me. Like He's coming down, it looks like. Yeah. like yep. That's my target. I have to kick. I need one of their disguises. He's staring at me. Checking me out. Mm-hmm. So now... It's a hell of a uniform you got there. That's yeah. Carl Ingram. Providence partner and brass balls billionaire. A legendary political fixer, Ingram is old money and as rotten as they come. In our clandestine approach. Guys, I'm gonna poison the whiskey. I, I really don't know like to be any other way like to do this cautiously and stealthily. I'm gonna be ready for when they see me. Okay, they might possibly see me. Illegal action. Well, see, does that mean they'll see me? We're gonna take a risk, guys. Here we go. Who are you? Hey, you. Now, if I take off, will they chill out? You. Oh, it smells delicious. Carl Ingram finally gets what he deserves. He died. He now let's get Marcus Stuyvesant. Come on, come on, guys. Okay, let's just hide in here. We might be good. Whoo! Perfect. Nice. All right. One down, finally. Now, for the next target. People in here just working and stuff, not even knowing what's about to happen. Any news on the new guard signed a code name Pinky? I got word that he entered the building, but he hasn't reported for duty yet. Probably oh. still down in the depot, getting his uniform. Oh, I just boy. hope he's got his papers with him. I heard rumors that he used to work for that Dowwood Rangan. You know, the Bollywood producer who died. This is sound intimate. promising. <laughs> no, nope, it doesn't. Take this. Okay. Stuyvesant is expecting a replacement guard. If you can locate him, we should be able to get within strangling distance of the little worm. Hmm. Okay, whatever. It's good to know, though. 
I think when we take out our second dude, we're just gonna be a savage about it. it really depends. Let's see. Whoa. He's right there. There he is. Right there. Okay. That's Marcus Stuyvesant, Providence partner, self entitled and arrogant little worm. Hmm. He might not look like much, but he's done more damage to the world than you could dream. I expect the best. Of course, sir. We'll let you know. Good. And please, when I come back, no more excuses. I'm a personal friend of His Royal Highness Omar El Ghazali. Really? I got him by himself. Perfect. I can't mess this opportunity up. What's it? Oh, he's following me. We got him, 47. Soon there will be no more providence. You need to find an exit. Our business is done here, but it's far from over. Anybody hear that? Okay, I mean, I guess. I'll put him in there. Alright. Uh. Oh, no, no, no. Gotta go. See you later. Move, man. Gotta go. Okay, well. Will they go away if I hide in here? I hear, I hear something. We oh. lost the target, damn it. Yes, you did. You lost the target. Yes. Anybody there? No, you can't Come find in. me. Hey, listen, I'm telling you, there's Ooh. a guy killing people out there. Nah. Some kind of, uh, what do you call it? Costume? Do I have to change my outfit now? How am I compromised? They're leaving. How do I change outfits? Oh, they revealed my uh my disguise. Do I not have other clothes I can switch into? I don't. I might have to shoot my way out of this. Okay, if I kill them, I can hurry up take the outfits. I I'm just gonna, guys. At this point. We about to okay. Let's do it. How do I reload? How do I reload my damn gun? I don't see it anymore. Move. Lost visual. Lost visual. Anyone got eyes on Tango? Can't see him either. Shit! Come on. For the love of God! Someone that, help! Are they coming? Where the hell is he? We gotta find him. God. Get out okay. of here! Now! We're good? Move, move. I, I switch outfits. Come and pick up the bodies? Uh, I think we're gonna run out of bags at this rate. That's crazy. You, you okay? You should get up now. Just take it slowly. You may be in shock. Come on, securing now. Am I supposed to clean this mess up? Still compromised? Damn, we lost track of the bastard. Oh. Come on, Hey, look alive, buddy. 
Oh, woo! Okay. All right. I'm still compromised a little bit, but I switched my outfit, so I should be good. Okay, 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 okay. We're on our way out. Almost there. Think we're in the clear, boys. Think we're in the clear. I think we out of here. Come on. Woo! Let's get up out of here, man. It took forever. Let's go. we got death from above four hours later we eliminated our targets okay there's a lot of stuff we utilized okay but there's so much that we missed sniper coming in from the window dang there's so many different ways you could have gone with this the man behind the curtain okay That's your winning face. I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the constant. Yeah, he's a glorified desk clerk. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. We caught him once. We can do it again. And, well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. Hmm. I don't like executive decision makers. Are they talking about Miss Burnwood? Look. You don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did, she'll make it right. She always does. What did he do? We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. Who's this? Miss Burnwood. How did you... I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. What? You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. Huh. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. Is she, like, involved in something that we're not supposed to know about? Alright guys, and there you have it. Episode 1 of Hitman 3 is complete. It was a little tricky because I've, like I said, I've never played before, so like I was trying to learn the controls, stuff like that. But I'm starting to get, I'm starting to get used to it. It is going to be a bit challenging because in these missions, there's so many different ways that we can eliminate the target, and I'm going to want to exploit these options. And then at the end there, who was it that called Miss Burnwood, and what was it that she was involved in? It kind of seemed like she had a, a couple skeletons in her closet. Maybe we'll find out later. In episode two, you can already see the name of the title: Death in the Family. So it looks like we're going to get further infiltration and we're going to um, figure out what exactly is going on and where these three uh, covenants are at or whatever they're called. The three, whatever. The three musketeers. That's what I'm going to call them. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Hitman. Please let me, truly, let me know your thoughts on this episode because this was a bit different. Um, it, it is tedious. Like, it's very, uh, it's time consuming. You really got to plan things out and try to figure stuff out and go about it a different way. So it takes time and it, it, it is a little different from what I'm used to. Comment section down below how you guys felt and any other games you guys want me to play. If you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. It will help this channel grow and bring more people to join the Real Squad family. Make sure you subscribe and share. Alright, so until next time guys, take care and I'm going to see you in the next video.